Hi everyone and welcome back to Arctic RC today for TopRCHobby.com and we got a new model today and this one I have been wanting to have on my table for a long time um, it's a GB uh, sort of a stretch one future, uh, futuristic GB and here you can see So we are quickly going to take out what's in the box, um, just talk a little bit about it, threw it on the turntable as usual so you can get a closer look at what's in the box, then mount the plane, then do some beauty shots and hopefully out on the field flying. Okay so we start with the manual, um, just going to open it and go through the specs before we take the rest. So the manual states um, battery 2200 milliamp 11.1 uh, volt that means 3 cell battery uh, it's a 30 amp brushless ESC and you have uh, servos 9 grams uh, times 2 and 17 grams times 2 these are of course digital servos uh, the wingspan is 1200 millimeter uh, the overall length is 1140 millimeters, uh, weight 1150 grams, uh, thrust about 1200 grams, flying time about 5 minutes. Um, I'm going to check the motor and the ESC because they do upgrade these so I'm not sure if they are in, um, in the same order as in the manual but that we will find out, so let's just empty this box. Starting off with the wing, I really like the color on this one, I am a sucker for black and white uh, and red, so let's open it. Oh. That is just beautiful, huh? Such a beautiful wing and the colors, they really, really pop. Next wing, next wing. Ninety-nine or sixty-six. We have the horizontal stabilizer. I did see a review once um, where the person th that did the review, he, he just smelled the, the parts. And actually it smells good, freshly painted. Beautiful, and the vertical stabilizer. Really thick and good quality. I'm not sure if it zooms or focuses, but anyway. We are going to take a closer look at the parts later. Oh my god! Check these wheels out and the wheel coats. Uh, everything is molded on top of this uh, steel wire or steel rod. So nothing breaks. I can't wait to mount this plane and see how it looks. Jesus, beautiful. Wheel. Check this out. <laughs> Oh, she is really sexy. Oh, 
Wow, she is really, really beautiful. I'm, I'm just looking so forward to fly this. Oh, beautiful. The motor with the propeller and the ESC. And some hardware. And some bolts and some glue, of course, is required. We are going to talk a little bit about uh, what to use the glue for when we are done with the turntable shots. see we are done mounting this beautiful GB and I gotta say the quality it's it's just amazing uh, the way to assemble it uh, the side rudder is snap on into a track the horizontal stabilizer is put in mounted with one screw the only thing that you need to glue is glue the main wings together with glue that comes with the plane or you can use uh, your preferred glue of course. Mount the spring wires for the wing on the bottom and the top and she is ready to go. And yeah of course you need to assemble um, the motor but you just push it in the nose and tighten one screw. Remember to use Loctite when you are tightening this screw so the motor don't come off during flight. This is really for me a showstopper. Uh, she's beautiful and as you can see well thought and great quality. The overall plane is in EPO which means that she will handle some hard landings, she will hand, uh, handle some rough beating and it's easy to fix and easy to glue. Uh, battery hatch there is a little room in the battery hatch so you might want to dig out some foam if you have some larger 3 cell battery. Uh, I have uh, uh, Gens Ace 3 cell battery and they are a bit big these 2200 milliamps so they will fit um, just barely in the well but it isn't any problem digging out foam to get the battery in. And the battery slides right in and won't have any movement at all. So a beautiful feature. Nothing more for me to say right now. We are heading out to the airfield. So stay tuned for the maiden flight. <laughs> 